Yo, P Ray in here, bro. It's Ray Uh-oh. GFT. We got content. Whack 100 and Brick Baby running a play on Lamonte, and they go in on Big U. What? Hey, yo, Ray, let's get to the content. It's Ray Gift TV. In the block. This is you hear me be like, yeah, I got exclusive. Yeah, got exclusive going. Uh, yep, yep. Talk to Brick, baby. You know, and that nigga, Brick told me, you know, I had to record you. The powers could be, you know. Oh. Brick like whack. That nigga really had that nigga. I said, what if you'd have really been giving him some real shit? On some real cause you thought they was team player because of your unk. What if you really would have just been talking like we didn't caught you talking two, three, four times. I'm trying to teach you how to talk when you know that they listening to you talk. He said, man, this nigga really he said this nigga would have never did it. If the boy had that boy had to give him the green. I said, you know the old saying. You ain't a rolling 60 until you get rid of a rolling 60. They trying to get rid of you, Brick. I said, are you ready for a WAC 100 to empower you? He said, nigga, I'm rolling whatever way you rolling. I said, we gonna set it up. We gonna really give them something to talk about while we laugh at what they was talking about. And let's see if they can figure it on out. I don't know having things. What you thinking? <laughs> I mean, having things you have respectfully been watching on Wack 100 for quite a long time. Right, right, for sure. You know, huh? you know, your right. sister told me, nigga, I'm gonna. He kept talking about you got to let's watch this shit and come on this shit. He said, yeah. I was wondering what the fuck is this nigga watching. I'm like, the fuck is that? And boom, right. So I don't know why. This dummy didn't say, how am I going to say what is calling when the call already went to what? Nine days ago. It's right there. Yeah, man. He just took the... Damn. Boy, easy as hell. Boy, now, here go another key. To the world, Brick Baby and Do Films, is, they don't like whack. So how any of y'all know what's going on with Wack? And Wack voice ain't, ain't on nothing. Ain't the Deuce Hills nigga ain't even from LA? He from LA. He just been living in, in Madison, Wisconsin for 15 years. He jumped through in the truck, went to the PM4, and he's living in Madison, somewhere, Wisconsin. If you stay somewhere in excess of 10 years, you from there now. I'm, I'm with you, I'm with you with that, though. I'm with you with that. I'm <laughs> no, that's real. You, you yeah, really. I know. You really don't let R and B hear you say that. What happened? What happened? Five said, <clears throat> "If you stay somewhere ten years or better, that's what you from." Oh yeah, you full of bullshit. That's not true. Look, <laughs> I'm definitely she not from me Vegas. That. You from the West Coast, nigga? Absolutely not. <laughs> nah, but I will say, <clears throat> he been in. Madison was Madison, Wisconsin for 15 years for real. So where he at is he got a little Mexican girl he with, she got a little lash bar. But I can't believe that dummy. That nigga got that excited and really went and did that shit. I know. Yeah, they go. They go. <laughs> she crazy. Like this, R&B. <clears throat> Why was I pissed off at 600? What I tell that nigga? He fucked up the play because you weren't able to get the content. That's all it was. I was going to get on the phone with him. I haven't done I was going to definitely get on the phone with him. I was going to definitely hear him out. Recording in progress. <laughs> yeah, man. I mean, like, it, like, would you, like, when he... I don't know. I wouldn't have been able to trust that shit. Like, even if he was, like, off the... Them niggas, I keep telling y'all, them niggas is dummies, bro. 
Bro, them niggas is dummies. I know them niggas. You gotta remember, bro. I help them niggas navigate yeah. their life. I know, know them niggas. Them niggas. They don't think that far, bro. The only reason why that nigga wanna squash it with me is to alienate and isolate 600 mm-hmm. in hopes that I allow him to do some business. That's the only reason why he wanna squash it. You heard what that nigga said? Wack was up there hundred deep. Only reason why. I called R&B immediately. I said, R&B, listen to this shit this nigga telling me. She heard it when I heard it. I just got a call from Bearclaw. <clears throat> Big U had him call. He want to squash it with Wack, but he ain't fucking with us. He don't trust us. He wish he would've never got into it with Wack, and he wanna let this shit. I'm just listening. Hey, I got a what question I- though. Yeah. How you feel about how you feel about niggas that's 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 really tied to the? I I don't know. I don't. I ain't gonna say really tied to the street, but. I'm speaking it for Brick Baby in general. Like, how you feel about niggas who who come from the street, I guess, and and they they taking a shot at the media game? Oh shit! I don't feel no kind of way, nigga. Y'all nah, that's real. He's shit. He shit. It's like me telling I, a nigga that's trying to be an actor, a nigga trying to be. A... I just feel like this shit just be like dope a little bit. Like these niggas, at, at, these niggas get that high, bro, and then. At, at some point, it's all about that high. Like, they don't, they don't give a fuck. Brick, baby, we don't give a about no streets. I'm already knowing Hell that. Hell no, that nigga got nigga came on the internet. He came out on the internet and told niggas he run Atlanta. Like, like man, he burnt out. Well, that's clickbait. But he, I'm he, already knowing. He don't care about no streets, man. That nigga don't care about no streets. Back 100 and Brick, baby, running a play. On Lamonte and Big Q. What you were right again? I'm coming down below. Let's get back to it. And r and a picture today. What my motivation was. This is live right here. Nigga, that's my motivation in my PTR. Right there. That's the streets. Anything that get a nigga farther away from that is what a nigga gonna keep doing. And that's a fact. I came out the barbershop and that's what I saw. I took a picture and sent it to R&B. I said, yes, yeah, this, this right here is the reason why I don't stop. Hell no. You talking about... <laughs> you think you talking about some streets. Nigga, streets. Every nigga in the streets, nigga, of any type of age, got any type of sense, any nigga over the age of... Of 16, 15, 16 has figured out this ain't where you want to stay. In the streets, I had growing fine Woody out here, man. The street is over with. Man. I'm happy over you right. said that because I was just about to say that. They've been know. over with. I've been telling niggas that. I don't know I've been telling did, niggas that. Man. Yeah. Because whoever got the most money won. And guess what? Anybody can make money now. So. And now they can kill a rat. Rats on the street. What did I tell oh, you? Man. What did I tell you, Faye? That in the next three to five years, it's gonna be yeah, more than killer. That's the, the worst type of nigga. Kill you, you, you can't win with that nigga. Shit, I gotta go. To, we gotta go. What the f- other place we going on? Be what's I be forgetting the name of? Bahrain. No, the other one. The one we got for the casinos. Oh shit. Uh- is that we gotta go for that casino play? Albania. Oh, we gotta go to Albania, Congo, Nigeria. I don't give a f. No nigga talking about no streets. And they ain't fighting in the Congo? Yeah, on the east side, not the west side. Uh, I go to the capital. Going to the capital, Albania. They build casinos. They want me to be the the head of operations when it come to all they talent coming over there. I told them for give me a nice penthouse in there and some points in the casino and a nice salary. 
you, 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 you get me out there 60 days out the year. No problem. We just inked another deal the other day. I got to start talking about this shit because the artist don't like this shit. Ain't another deal. They create a union for the rappers. So what that's going directly against the music industry? Um, the they create a union for the rappers. They, they go on the fire. You get a one-stop shop. You can come over there, do your merch, do your YouTube, and do your... Do your, your streaming, you could do everything on there, you register. They got There's a little partner fee. with the they got a little fee for the year. They go find all your money. They got a million dollar tournaments they do on a year in Vegas where they live is registered on there to win a million dollars. You know what I mean? Uh they renting out the what's that shit called RP? The sphere. They got a five day event gonna be bigger than Coachella. So I just contracted to them. For a nice salary. Shit. You gonna be Fuck at Rolling about, Loud this year? On no damn streets. I don't know. Uh, if shit, I gotta get a nigga out of jail first. Shit. <laughs> shit. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, jail. But I don't know. I mean, it depends on when it is. It's because the art is there. If I gotta be somewhere else, I just send a nigga with him. Like, we got some traveling to do. Yeah. Hey that nigga on um, hey that nigga Jacquees, that's just cash money like he just like on the regular cash money shit like you be you Jacquees cash money yeah that's the homie that's nephew yeah, him and Birdman had a hit they never let go I got them on my phone I told that nigga earlier you need to hit record I feel like but, uh, he I feel like he he got it though like yeah I, but it's, what's crazy is I talk about this all the time you got those artists. They got it, they good and all that, but for whatever reason, the people don't grab it. I don't know why. You know what I'm saying? It happens like that. Yeah, yeah. I felt like Twister had it. <laughs> Just keeping it real when he first came out, but you know. Nah, that nigga did have a little. Right? They only go so far for whatever reason. You know, he really can't really, you know. Uh, Eric Bellinger got it. Shit, he wrote half of Chris Brown hits. I feel like he got it, but I think he got to think his personality is a little too quiet. Yeah, that just like the Ed Sheeran nigga. Like, oh, Ed Sheeran make amazing music, but I just so that, no, but that nigga fan base is crazy. crazy. Hell yeah, but he a cracker with red hair. Like, hey, you better put that nigga on a song with a nigga or something. And that's what he do. Get no, on the song. That fan base is crazy. Hell yeah, you know he wrote Rod Wave shit too. Did he? Yeah, yeah. Nigga, fan base is crazy. And Dan Sharon got 67 million monthly listeners, nigga. That nigga a dog. That nigga got four, seven, eight, nine, ten, twelve. That nigga top five is 14 billion. Mm -hmm. I got a whole album done with Dan Sharon and Game. Yeah, yeah, that's that best that nigga right there. Yeah. Yeah, so I don't know. You know, sometimes it's, I don't know what it be. Think they hide for this shit. The people don't support. What's up, Mimi? You coming out? I'm in the room. She can come up. She can only come to the hunting side. <laughs> wow. Hey, what's up, Mimi? What's up, Mimi? Hey, Is that what's going on, Mimi? Hell yeah, don't be hate. I the niggas, say, the niggas say, I respect the hunting side. The mother motherfuckers are too crazy. <laughs> he said that about us too, Mimi? Nah, hell no. <laughs> Yeah. He said I was talking like before, so he was like, you said you was on there and they don't sound like that. <laughs> like, I said I would. He like, no the fuck you wouldn't. <laughs> I said, let me get my ass over there to the room I was in. 
<coughs> shit. You see my my message be shit. That's why I was like, uh, I can't really say. Are you busy, Red Gatorade? Yeah, you know I work. I'm at work. And then, like, she if she hears certain stuff, I, I can lose my job, so I can't be. I gotta have my phone on low. Stop saying that. Man. On God, I can't, nigga, nigga, real. Like, that lady, she's schizophrenic. She hears certain things that trigger her. Because this shit get loud. It's, going, it's called uh, <clears throat> Global Hip Hop Authority. Shit gonna be crazy. Yo, know, I, mean, I gotta get me hit this nigga by my page. Let me start pressing him by my page. I need him back for this shit. About what? By my page. I'm gonna need it back for to start promoting that global hip hop authority shit. Oh, that what you were talking about with the casinos? No, 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 that's something different. Global hip hop authority, that's the new platform. They're gonna be like a union for artists. Oh, okay. He said, shit. He said I did on no way. It says support. All right, so it's on the way back. I feel you don't try to get into that, uh, that, that show shit, but. Right no, nah, I mean, you know. <clears throat> that motherfucking, uh, that Lemmy at that zoo shit. I ain't. I don't even like to give niggas credit like that. Was it another, is it, like, was it another platform with that concept where, like, you just had to pay them and you can only see some shit on that platform? I'm pretty sure it was. Um, it's a couple of shit. Goddamn, my, uh, Vlad is like that. Keep it real. Vlad is like that. Um, they doing their thing. That, that's the new thing right now. It takes too long to do a movie. Yeah, you like four to six years fucking with the movies and financing and shoot the motherfucker and <clears throat> casting it and editing and all that shit. When seven, when, when, when a million people gonna give you seven dollars every month. There you go. You can just, you can go <laughs> film some shit right now in, in July. The whole month of July, you could have filmed all you needed, added all August, and had it promoted September and drop it October. They killing that shit right now. Drop a comment down below. Let me know what y'all think about the content. Whack 100 and Break Baby ran a play on Lamonte. Fail for the okie doke. What do y'all think about that? The content will be contenting today for sure, and I will deliver. You already know how I'm giving it up. Keep that notification bell turned on at all times so you don't miss out on no premium content. And today, Break Baby will finally have a podcast with Whack. Wow, you know it's going up. I can't wait to see this. Brick gonna come in there like, hey, whack on rolling. Bro, I've been waiting on this day, bro, like on rolling. Like, we about to go viral, bro, for real. Yo, y'all know how Brick give it up, man. But everybody out there gritting and grinding, apply yourself, be proactive, and make it happen, man, for real. Don't wait on it. Go out and grab it. You feel me? Life's too short. But until next time, it's your boy Ray Giffen. I'm gone. God bless. Peace. Thanks for watching another reaction video. I'm out.